I had to go with the puffy sleeves with Bridgerton. Absolutely. Yes, yes. Congratulations to the three of you ladies, my favorite ladies on the show. I've seen season two twice now. Absolutely loved it. Wow. I know. Wow. I'm a huge, huge fan. Congratulations to all three of you. Honestly, one of the best scenes this season is when, without too many spoilers, is when we get a glimpse of the king and his relationship with the queen. All of you are involved in that scene. And honestly, I just wanted to take you take me back in reading that scene and then take me back to set with being on set that day and filming that. Golda, I want to begin with you because that was such an emotional scene. And we've never truly quite seen the queen like this before. Yeah, I think that's um, it's really lovely and beautiful to have that and see where the queen is now with that relationship. But also, you know... For me, it was really interesting to have my best mates there, you know, and my best mates who I've kind of, who know my secret, who are my confidants. And also to also have the Sharmas, that kind of dynamic of others that don't know the secret and to kind of play that, but also the real friendship and sisterhood in that scene. You know, sometimes the girls had their backs to me and it was, I felt very lonely, but also um, very connected. Um, there's a great deal of beautiful history there with, with us girls and, and the characters. But um, I would love to know how and what the girls thought of that scene um, as well, mm. just in terms of like the relationship and what they thought of how, how it was. For me, when you talk, Goldra, about how us being aware of your a secret of yours, it felt very much like that. It felt for, in terms of Violet, that it was something that she should not be privy to. And it was, it, it was, it was awkward and uh, humbling and, and also he is our king. So it's kind of, you know, I, I you know, it, it was, it was sort of, sort of extraordinary really. And, and privy to a secret that we should not have been privy to it, as far as Violet is concerned. It's kind of like the public and the private, isn't it? That the public and the private kind yeah. of go in that moment, yeah. Yeah. Um, which I think I, is really interesting. I think I think Lady Danbury, I I felt like I've watched your whole marriage. <laughs> I've watched the young yous. I've watched the young yous kind of coming together and becoming this team that produced seventy five million children, um, and uh, <laughs> you know. And, um, and I, I know your private grief and I mourn with you and I do that thing that sometimes happens. You know, when uh, it, it, that thing where you're, you're suffering with something so much and you know, if somebody is nice to you, yeah, you will crumble. Yeah. And so mm. when, he, when he, when he, yeah. So when, and I think it's, I think it's such a human response. So in that moment, when the come, king comes in and it's so, that the, it's so raw and exposing and vulnerable making for the queen, I feel like the one, the one thing I have to do is like have a complete fixed gaze and not look at you. I'm so, I feel the heat coming off you. You're just over the shoulder. And I, it's like, don't look at her. I know you want to look at her because you love her. Do not look at her. She has got to keep her stuff together so do you, you know, do you do you look at the king um i look i look in his uh i look in his direction but i never look him directly in the yeah. eye because it would confuse him yeah yeah uh, right. and, and, and i think and we all we absolutely all did you know the correct obeisance because it's like that's recognizable yeah um uh, yeah, because we didn't really kind of deeply discuss the scene, which I think is really good. Mm. A real natural um, um, empathy, yeah, there, and a real kind of honest empathy and a truthful yeah. empathy, and one that's um, you know, I'm a very instinctual actress, and I think the instinct that all of us have in that scene comes from the immediate, comes from the fizz of ideas, fizz of emotions, um, which is which are played out. Uh, the, that, the unspoken stuff is is really interesting. Yeah, isn't that the? I think that's the strength of these women together. Yeah. Mm. It's, it's these actresses together being these women together. Is that? Um, everybody is very, very good at what they do. You know, we're long lived. We've been doing it a while. And so, you know, we, we can play with authenticity and we know who these 
these women are that we're inhabiting. So we can, you can give us the scene. Uh, I think you could give us pretty much any scene actually. And we will be able to respond authentically to the moment. Well, thank you ladies so much. I love all of your memories from that one scene because it's literally such a staple this season. And I think that fans are gonna really love it. Thank you ladies so much for your time. I absolutely love this season and I cannot wait for seasons three and four. I'm ready to watch <laughs> them right now. <laughs> ah, brilliant. Love thank you ladies so much. Bye-bye.